God is knocking at the door of your heart today, folks. He's knocking at the door of your heart and he's saying time is running out. You don't have much longer to come and get your heart right with God. Jesus is knocking at your heart through the preaching of his word. Do not harden your heart when you hear the preaching of God's word being preached. Do not ignore the knock of God when he's knocking at your heart, sir. Because one day the knock might stop knocking and then it's gonna be too late, sir. You're gonna die in your sin and you're gonna go to hell. Yet, you don't have to go to hell. That's the message of the Bible. It's repent, don't go to hell, come out the darkness of sin. Believe in the Lord, ma'am. Come to God while there's still breath in your body. Turn to the Lord, sir. God offers salvation through his son, Jesus Christ. For there is no other name given amongst men that we can be saved, but it's only through Jesus. You got saints shirts on, guys. You can become real saints of God. You can get born again and come to Jesus. You can believe in the gospel, sir. The Bible says if you're not born again, you will not enter into God's kingdom. You got to be born again, folks. You got to repent and come to God. You got to lay down your life of rebellion, young man. If not, you don't have no hope. Your only hope is to lay down your life of rebellion, wave the white flag of surrender, and come to God and confess your sin and say, God, have mercy on me, a sinner, and repent and believe the gospel and lay hold of this precious gift of salvation that God is offering through his son, Jesus Christ. Yet, time is running out. The clock is ticking down. Do you hear the clock, sir? Tick, tock, tick, tock. Soon, sir, the clock is gonna stop ticking and you're going to stand before because God. Because Jesus created that angel that went to hell and he didn't stop him. If he's got everything in his power, he can stop him. So Jesus supports hell. Yeah, Jesus does. He supports hell for rebellious sinners. Jesus made hell for those who want to live in rebellion. Yeah, you stick the middle finger. And that's where you're going, ma'am, when you die. You are going to hell if you do not repent. You are going to bust hell wide open if you don't get right with God. And God's warning you today. There's mercy for you, ma'am, but you have to lay down your hard heart of rebellion and come to God and say, God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Come to the Lord, repent, and really believe. Because if not, sir, there's no hope for you. You'll live your life here and it won't be long. And before you know it, your life will come to an end. And all the walking the streets of New Orleans, it will be no more, sir. Once you die, you cannot walk the streets of New Orleans anymore. And when you die without salvation, sir, you go to hell. There's no walking the streets in hell fire. There's no partying in hell fire. When you go to hell, all the partying, it all comes to an end, folks. You have one opportunity to get right with God, and it's now. Today is the day of salvation, guys. Today is the day of salvation because you're not promised tomorrow, sir. You might think you're gonna live long, but you're not promised tomorrow. Death can come to you tonight, sir. Is your heart right with God? Are you prepared to meet thy God, folks? Are you prepared to stand before the God that has created you? The Bible says you will stand before God and you will give an account. And without the salvation of the Lord, ma'am, you're going to go to hell. Ma'am, God can heal that heart. You know that, right? You know that? He's got a dollar. And he's got a dollar. Ma'am, please get right with Jesus. You, 
You can you can put that drunkenness down and God can heal that heart. Ma'am, please think about your soul. Because if you die in your sin, you're gonna go to hell, ma'am. Please. God sent his son to die for you, but if you keep going on in rebellion, you're gonna go to hell, ma'am.